Nikola Tesla did countless mysterious experiments, but he was a whole other mystery on his own. Almost all genius minds have a certain obsession. Nikola Tesla had a pretty big one. Tesla had some interesting habits that he would do. For example, he would walk around the block repeatedly, three times before entering a building. He would clean his plates with 18 napkins. He lived in hotel rooms, only with a number divisible by three. He would make calculations about things in his immediate environment to make sure the result is divisible by three. He would do everything in sets of three. Some say he had OCD, and others say he was very superstitious. However, the truth is a lot deeper. If you knew the magnificence of three, six, and nine, you would have the keys to the universe. Nikola Tesla His obsession was not simply with numbers, but especially these numbers, three, six, and nine. Tesla claimed that these numbers were extremely important and nobody listened. But why these numbers? What did Nikola Tesla try to make the world understand? First, we must understand that we did not create math, we discovered it. It's the universal language and law. No matter where you are in the universe, one plus two will always equal to three. Everything in the universe obeys this law. There are patterns that naturally occur in the universe. Patterns that we've discovered in life. Galaxies, star formations, evolution, and almost all natural systems. Some of these patterns are the golden ratio and sacred geometry. One really important system that nature seems to obey is the power of two binary system, in which the patterns start from one and continues doubling the numbers. Cells and embryos develop following this sacred pattern. One, two, 4, 8, 16, 32, etc. Some call these patterns the blueprint of God. Math by this analogy would be God's thumbprint, leaving all religion aside. In Vortex Math, the science of Taurus anatomy, there is a pattern that repeats itself. 1, 2, 4, 8, 7, and 5, and so on. As you can see, 3, 6, and 9 are not in this pattern. Scientist Marco Rodin believes these numbers represent a vector from the third and fourth dimension, which he calls a flux field. This field is supposed to be a higher dimensional energy that influences the energy circuit of the other six points. Randy Powell, a student of Marco Rodin, says that this is the secret key to free energy, something we all know Tesla mastered. Let me explain. Let's start from 1. Doubled it is 2. 2 doubled it is 4. 4 doubled is 8. 8 doubled is 16, which means 1 plus 6, that equals to 7. 16 doubled is 32, resulting in 3 plus 2 equals 5. You can do 7 doubled, if you want, to which you would get 14, resulting in 5. 32 doubled is 64 resulting in total of 1. So if we continue, we will keep following the same pattern. 1, 2, 4, 8, 7, 5. 1, 2, 4, 8, 7, 5, etc. over and over. As you can see, there is no mention of 3, 6, and 9. It's like they are beyond this pattern, free from it. However, there is something strange once you start doubling them. 3 doubled is 6, 6 doubled is 12, which would result in 3. Add 1 and 2 and you get 3. In this pattern, there is no mention of 9. It's like 9 is beyond, completely free from both patterns. But if you start doubling 9, it will always result in 9. This is called the symbol of enlightenment. If we go to the Great Pyramid of Giza, not only are there three larger pyramids at Giza, all side by side, mirroring the positions of the stars in Orion's belt, but we also see a group of three smaller pyramids 
immediately away from the three larger pyramids. We find lots of evidence that nature uses threefold and sixfold symmetry. These shapes are in nature, and the ancients emulated these shapes in the building of their sacred architecture. Is it possible that Tesla uncovered this profound secret and uses knowledge to push the boundaries of science and technology? The Magnificence of the Number 9 Let's say there are two opposites. Call them white and black if you want to. They are like the north and south poles of a magnet. One side is 1, 2, and 4. The other side is 8, 7, and 5, just like electricity. Everything in the universe is a stream between these two polar sides, like a swinging pendulum. And if you could imagine the movement, it's something like the symbol for infinity. However, these two sides are governed by 3 and 6. 3 governs 1, 2, and 4, while 6 governs 8, 7, and 5. And if you look at the pattern closely, it gets even more mind-boggling. 1 and 2 equals 3. 2 and 4 equals 6. 4 and 8 equals 3. 8 and 7 equals 6. 7 and 5 equals 3. 5 and 1 equals 6. And 1 and 2 equals 3. The same pattern on a higher scale is actually 3, 6, 3, 6, 3, 6. But even these two sides, 3 and 6, are governed by 9, which shows something spectacular. Looking closely at the pattern of 3 and 6, you realize that 3 and 6 equals 9. 6 and 3 equals 9. All the numbers together equal 9, both ways, excluding and including 3 and 6. So 9 means the unity of the both sides. 9 is the universe itself, the vibration, the energy, and the frequency. 3, 6, and 9. If you want to find the secrets of the universe, think in terms of energy, frequency, and vibration. Nikola Tesla There is a deeper philosophical truth in this. Just imagine what we could accomplish if we could apply the sacred knowledge in everyday science. The day science begins to study non-physical phenomena, it will make more progress in one decade than in all the previous centuries of its existence. Nikola Tesla